War Between Good and Evil Word received April 13, 2022 and released September 9, 2023 by Anonymous One. Transcript As all is being exposed, my children, you must now come to the realization that the end must take place after I gather my harvest. The days of the wicked are numbered, and their punishment for the evil committed will be far greater than anyone can imagine. I did not sit idly by and not keep records of all that has been done. I will destroy all the evil off the face of this earth. America is complicit in all the crimes against humanity, and for this reason destruction comes. They have spilled so much innocent blood for decades upon decades, generations upon generations, and now it is time for this vile nation to reap what it has sown. You are now witnessing how more and more blood is being spilled on your streets. Lawlessness has become the new normal. 1 John 3, 4 The son of perdition to be Antichrist is in the background orchestrating events with those who have joined hands with him, willing to murder to gain more kingdoms and territories that they will never receive in the end. Oh, how they will throw their fists in the air, cursing me as they burn for all eternity. I did not come to bring peace on earth, but a sword. Matthew ten thirty four through 36 you are living in the end of the age to come, and what will be will be, though none can fully comprehend my master plan that has been ordained from the beginning. I am is about to reveal my power through my chosen vessels. Miracles and healings will prove to many that I am the one and only true living God. You, my children, will see a display never witnessed before. Every knee will bow and every tongue will confess. What the wicked have done, I can restore. This will be done for an allotted time to bring my own who are lost back to me. Do not get too comfortable. The wicked will flee for a time and then again return at the appointed time. The heavens and earth will be rolled up like a scroll. Isaiah 34, 4 and Revelation six fourteen. All those who are mine will be free and already home with me. My chosen will work the fields as they are led by me. To those who refuse even then to repent and return, your only reward will be to go to the master you follow and to lie in the beds you have made for yourselves. Simply put it, you will perish and your name will be removed from the book of life. Revelation twenty fifteen. The harvest is ripe as the darkness darkens. This is a time like never before. A war between good and evil. You will see both, as so much evil is in your midst, yet this is also the time I will do my finest work. What is about to come will shock all, including some of my elect. Again, I say, get your spiritual house ready, and with fear and trembling, pray that you will be found worthy to escape what is coming. Luke twenty one thirty six. Pray without ceasing. All that has been ordained will be fulfilled, and then my kingdom on earth shall be established, and I shall rule with the rod of iron. Revelation 2.27 For now, my kingdom work shall be done through my chosen vessels, my army. For my will will be done on earth as it is in heaven. All will see my love, mercy, and grace to set the captives free. Isaiah 61.1 Luke 4, 18 through 19, and Mark 5, 1 through 20. I have spoken, I am the Lord, my glory I will not share with another. Isaiah 42, 8. That is it, child. A few minutes later, I heard him say out of love for his people, Come to me, all who are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Lay your burdens down at my feet. I long to heal you. For you to be with me. I love you. And that is the end of this message. Scripture to go along with the last verse is John 6, 35 
and Matthew 11, 28 through 30. Please remember to take everything that you hear in this message in prayer to the Lord Jesus Christ for any and all needed confirmations. Thank you for listening. God bless you all. And until next time, Shalom and Maranatha.